I guess it must be that the five elements are selfless self. Well, everything's occurring inside the selfless self, just like in a dream. When you lay down to sleep and the entire world is projected and that, that dream world is projected, you project the trees, the water, the air, the sky, the people, everything is coming out of you. So selfless self is the projector of this entire world, including the body that you believe yourself to be for a time that you can see that you are not when you mantra through. And then you can say like what we were talking about communicating with your own self. It's not that I'm this bot. I'm all the bodies, you know, I'm my presence is in every being. And sometimes that can actually be physically in, so to speak physically, but sensed, you feel that sense of presence. You know, I, I myself have gone many times and, and when I'm speaking to someone, quote, that recognition in the projection that you are my own self, without saying it, there's just a recognition in the projection. My presence is in every being. And that's why there's the spontaneity, because there's nothing blocking it. When I know my presence is in every being, like Maharaj says, publicity. Okay, so you're a one-man show that's selling tickets <laughs> to your own show, basically. So publicity just doesn't make sense. Like, you're on stage for your own self. You're in the audience, and you're on stage. So there's no one to impress. You know this, because there's no separate anything. As a matter of fact, if you try to impress then that subtle ego is formed, ideas and beliefs about whether this is occurring form, which immediately, because I am somebody else, then there's a you, and then there is a need to impress because I believe there could actually be someone out there that could be impressed. And money, again, fluffy clouds, because the money is whatever is going to be. It's, it's provided in the moment, it's here, and truly, I'm sure, if you're not desiring and going out and trying to, uh, you know, spend money on uh, everybody eventually comes down to like a budget or whatever. And the money is just, you just see it's going to be there. You know, even, I think we talked about before that the homeless people, if, if there was not, no power, so to speak, the selfless self wasn't providing for the needs and requirements of the bodies that were created from the five elements, there wouldn't be such a thing as a homeless person because after four or five days, they would starve to death and die. But even the homeless, even the very poor are, are eating, are, 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 are maintaining. Because again, the same one that took care of you in the womb for nine months took care of this form, which again, this form, man and woman get together and some like like Maharaj says it's like a spittle and that spittle is a little bit of a form and it forms and it gets food from the mother and continues to form and continues to form and it's just a blob of goo that's forming and then when it's born the energy is in it but it doesn't know itself it's just kind of there and until the recognition is oh there are others there is a me and then the label and the conditioning and all of this gets added on. Other, but in the womb, that form was created by the five elements, was part of the five elements, was maintained by the five elements, was fed and nourished by the five elements. And you, the selfless self, that was moving the heart and moving the blood and, and forming all these things from these five elements were growing a human being, basically.